Now, residents of Enyira community in a queer area of Lagos say they are tired of living in darkness. They are protesting their grievances at the power holding office in their community. Our reporter, Bowali Isaac, tells us more. Latest report by the Nigerian Bureau of Statistics, MBS, has it that Nigeria generates 4,000 megawatts, which is below the expected generation a nation like Nigeria should have, based on its existing power plants. Meanwhile, the commercial hub of the economy is expected to have a free flow power supply due to market share it holds for the nation's economy. But the case is different for the Enyura community around Ekbe area in Lagos, where the community members have come out in the numbers to voice out their frustration over the non-availability of power supply in the area. This is coming as leaders and members led a peaceful protest to the Eco Electricity Distribution Company, EKECD. For us not having light, there's no security because without light, we don't have a security. And we are running on Gen 24 hours. So it's, it's really affecting us and we are we are facing crazy bill every time. It's really affecting us because we don't have light. Even the, it, there's no light, my children are not feeling, feeling comfortable. And the business we are doing, we can't, we can't move because we have, we have no cold drink, cold, cold water to drink. So it's, it's really affecting us. Representatives of a community relate to us the resolution of their meeting with a power company. We've been experiencing these uh, uh, estimated bills for months, even for years. We don't have light, constant light. Even the whole thing was being done by community effort. But we still we keep receiving bills over bills. And today we let them know that, yes, we must put, put a stop to it. Enough is enough for estimated bills. We've been able to meet with the top stars and uh, we've come to a, an understanding that in two months' time, we have prepaid meter. And uh, the SMD have promised us to come and rectify the low current that we've been experiencing presently. As the power holding company plead for more time to allow them address the complaints, this, they said, may result into procurement of another transmitter to boost supply to the area and provision of prepaid meters to check alleged estimated bill. It is, however, the hope that a company will live up to their promises within a short period of time to prevent a repeat of this scenario. Bowale Isaac, Silverbird News 24.